Hello, today I'll be showing you how to use an image that you have in Google Drive and generate a URL that you can actually embed in a website. So the current functionality of Google Drive, including for pictures, is that when you upload it into Google Drive and share the link, what people will actually get when they click that link or when you use that link is be sent to a preview of that file that they can then choose to download or print or um, some of the additional other functionality. If I wanted to use this picture on a website and embedded within the website, I wouldn't be able to. So instead, I'm going to show you how to generate a URL from that file that you can embed into a website and have it load like any other picture that's part of that website. So step number one, we have to make sure that our image is a public image. Anyone visiting our website will be able to see it. There's no need to sign into Google Drive. So I'll right click on the image and go to share. And then I will click on advanced. Here I see that my image is currently private. So I will go change and then enable link sharing so that anyone with the link will be able to see this picture. After all, if it will be on the website, we want to make sure that anyone visiting the website can see that image. So step one, enable anyone with a link to view this image. Step two, we need to get the file ID of our image. So the file ID is this middle portion of the URL that's currently being highlighted on the screen. So the easiest way to take that is to copy the whole thing and paste it into a Word doc. Now that I have the full URL here, I can very easily take just the file ID and then copy it. Finally, the last thing I need to do is take a set uh, URL and that's going to be available to you in the description so you don't have to memorize this. But I'm going to use the set URL that I've gotten and I'm going to paste my file ID to the end of that URL. So this whole thing combined will now actually act as the link for that image. And I can actually embed this into a website incorporated into HTML. And when it's used on a website, it will point directly to that image. And it will act like any other image on a website. There you go. Thanks for watching.